Hi, it's Travis here, and welcome back to our adventures in Azeroth. Last episode, we saved Shuja Grimax from the Ogres. They're trying to sacrifice her so they could summon an undead dragon. And they're trying to sacrifice every living thing on this island so that they could summon it. And then we also saved Herbert Gloomburst from a bunch of harpies. And I think they were trying to sacrifice him as well. Let's continue this quest chain. We here. must rescue the others. Message to base. Perhaps my mother was right. Together we stood against the harpies and claimed victory. Let us return to camp with Herbert in tow. We're one step closer towards thwarting the orgers and their plans to revive that dragon. Elements guide you. It looks like we well get some pants fought. for that. We're one step closer to crushing. I also seen uh, seen this quest over here. I want to give it a try. Whoever this is, lights on. Ah, you are in league with the ogres. You're not in league with the ogres. Please, you, roust aid me. You must aid me. I have been bound against my will by dark magic. I ask only that you free me. Take a piece of my light. Use it to dispel the necrotic energies that are keeping me captive. You have to use the light spawn's light to dispel nearby necrotic energy. Then dispel the foul magic that binds me here. Okay. I have a feeling we're gonna have to fight you after this. That's my guess. But we'll have to see. Maybe you will be an ally. I attempted to bring an end to these rituals. But the ogres ensnared me, drained my power. Free me so I might recover. And pass some of my power to you. <laughs> yeah. Let's see about that. The spell is weakening. The light returns to me. Freedom. You have my thanks, Rap You Dinko. have my gratitude. I must leave this world, but I wish you luck. Take my blessing. May it aid you against your monsters. Light speed. The light spawn blessing grants you a 60% speed boost for 10 minutes. May the pretty solid. Accept my blessing. Now we're super fast. Okay, so that was all right. Let's see if it, I wonder if it stacks with the uh, aspect of the cheetah. So for ten minutes we have a speed burst. But another thing we have to increase our uh, we have a mount. I've seen a couple a guy at the beginning of the episode with the Joker mount. I just remember I had this cool thing about this mount is. You can't get knocked off of it because you're not driving the mount since you're being chauffeured by a soger here. I mean, by this orc. They can't knock you off because they can't knock this orc off the mount. So it's a pretty cool mount for that. Stay focused on it is good mission. to see you all back in one piece. You are a testament to the horde's strength of will. Let's hope Gloomburst is as powerful as he is unhinged. Stay sharp. Danger surrounds us. Put that on. How you do Sell me some now. of our trash here. There we'll be go. seeing ya. Talk to Get me. Get rid of these pairs of pants. Stay away from of the course, you come to me for aid. Hunter's trap. If you want to be called a true hunter, you'll need to learn the art of trapping. Fortunately, I happen to be an expert in it. First, you will need to gather supplies from the surrounding areas so you can fashion a proper freezing trap. Herbert can supply you with a moat of ice, scavenge the area for the other materials. You'll need to trap to handle another issue that has recently arisen. Remember to tarry with those supplies. The so sooner you learn how to set guy. this trap, Necromancy. the better. Do you have the it's mode a I nice can use? Mode. Oh, sure. I've got plenty ever since the <laughs> accident. Let's pick up this uh, rusted chain. And then we'll go over here and we'll get this old spring. And that should help us... Uh, yeah, you're pretty fast with this. It does stack. Mithron Dawn Tracker. Hunter's At trap. your service. Did you require the necessary supplies? Herbert should have the ice mode while the other two should be nearby. With little work, this can become an effective trap. Part of what makes a real hunter is the resourcefulness to use what your environment provides. Shirella Ron. Go, level 8, guys. Hunting the Stalker. Now that you have your trap we can move on to the true problem at hand a strange creature not native to this land has been stalking our camp i think we should capture it and see how it can help us 
Set the freezing trap within these ruins and lure it out. We'll see just what we are dealing with. So we have to use Keep our set the freezing oh, trap freezing within trap the ogre these ruins. ruins. The beast that stalks our camp should emerge. Now we have aspect of the turtle now, which is nice. And freezing trap. I'll make. Uh, I don't know. I'll make it E. I guess. I put it right here. See what it does. Look, it approaches. Ah, caught it. Got him. See, we've caught a raptor. Wait, I recognize this beast. It was aboard our ship. It must have survived the crash. I don't know. Hawk Dingo might get jealous. I think we might have to stick with Hawk Dingo. The Eternal Sun guides us. Hunting the Stalker. I admit I am rather ashamed I did not immediately recognize this beast. It must quite be quite resilient if it was able to survive this song on its own. Here, let me teach you another trick. You'll want to have multiple pets to switch between if you're to be a hunter of any worth. Remember the day you met me. The Art of Taming. Quite the surprise to find this beast so hale and hearty. It seems to have taken a liking to you. If you, you're ever going to be as great as one of the dawn trackers you must learn how to handle multiple pets allow me to show you how Shirelleron. you must dismiss your current pet to tame another okay. you can call it back to you later there we go dismissing the pet give me the word once you are ready to tame the beast all right i'm ready to tame my there pet it goes. call them out tame it just like the one before I wonder if i need to like fight it to tame it Showing the pet love. Another beast now tamed. tamed. Easy. Now you must learn how to place them in a stable. Okay. Of course, you come I'd to like me. I'd like to stable my aid. pet here. I think we'll we're gonna keep Hawk Dingo. Right, we're gonna stable the Raptor for now. One day we'll probably use. Keep him. yourself safe. I don't believe there is anything left to teach you, Trav Dingo. Now you must go forth and find more beasts to tame and call your own. If you ever need to store or retrieve your pets, speak with me or any other stable master you encounter in your travels. Shirelleron. Okay. We won't rest until the, the last remaining has been survivor found. is being held within the Ogre Citadel. Krenna and Herbert have a plan to get us inside. A small group of us will gather north. You're coming with us. If we fail here, the ogres will rise. The dragon from the dead. We won't let For them the horde. Happen. Recruit. We push forward. The rest of you, hold this position. All right, so we have this new ability called Aspect of the Turtle. Deflects all attacks and reduces all damage you take by 30% for 8 seconds, but you cannot attack. Okay. So let's summon our pet out. Where's our pet? Yeah, I gotta call him. There we go. Let's go. Let's go, Hawk Dingo. So we got a little sign here. You see a crude sign made by the ogres. It contains a warning. Big bear bad. Big bear guard. Big ogre treasure. Kill after ritual. Get treasure. Make more powerful. Defeat kill claw. The terrible. Suggest three players. Okay, well, we're going to try it solo, I guess. And put him on attack. I need a target. Going to follow now. Okay, so we're gonna shoot this guy. So we're gonna I get some help here, closer. maybe. I think we can deal with this guy solo, though. Looks like we got two, so it should be pretty easy. He's attacking me. Does a little charge ability. Not bad. So we did it with two. So now I gotta check this little cave out here where all these slain ogres are. There's a bunch of cockroaches in here too. You find a cache of treasure just like the ogre sign mentioned. And it looks like we got a, got a pair of shoulders now, guys. So that was worth it. So let's use Aspect of the Cheetah. We'll meet up with... Uh, the Grim Axis.
the Warlord Horde. Breck again. Leave no one behind. Targmall Citadel looms ahead. Herbert's proposed plan is unconventional. We need to get inside Darkmall Citadel, rescue the last survivor, and stop the ogre necromancer behind all of this. Herbert and K Krenna are going to cast a spell to make you look like an ogre. And then you're going to take us in as your prisoners. We do not have the strength to launch a full-scale assault, so this will have to do. Speak with Don't Herbert when you're ready. Down. All right. Interested in some experimentation? Disguising you as an ogre in order to sneak into a base and stop a ritual to revive a dead dragon is crazy. I can't wait to get it started. I'm ready to transform me into an ogre and I'll sneak into their Stay citadel. Stay moderately safe. Ooh, a willing test subject. Such a rare find. Dude, we got some Good. <laughs> now act like an ogre and get us inside. All right, we got them all chained Don't up. Don't speak. Just smile and wave. The dumber you look, walk in. the better. More sacrifices. Go to cooking pit. Wave at Gorgoth. Show what you got. Yes. Keep moving. See if we can learn anything about the ritual. Let's go to cooking pit and we'll wave at this guy. There's Gorgoth. Let's give him a wave. What do we have here? All the sacrifices. Take them to the back. Slash we'll dance seal while you're them the with the wardstones, like we did their leader. It is time to complete the ritual atop the citadel. Then all will bow before us. Should we do a little dance? This one got some moves. Oh, this is hilarious. You dance good. <laughs> Look at this. Bunch of ogres dancing. I said dude. act like an ogre, not dance like one. Let's see this. No, they all stopped. No, oh, that's too bad. That was pretty funny. I wanted to keep going. So let's roll out here. I guess we need to go up to the tap. I wonder if I can use, like, my hunter abilities. No, I can't. I can only just do ogre stuff. Warlord Thunderwalker. We have to destroy those seals now! There's Warlord Thunderwalker. Raw strength won't be enough. We need to end the spell. We need to end the spell. Let's end it. We won't rest until the expedition There may has been just found. be a way that we can save Warlord Thunderwalker. Warlord Thunderwalker won't last much longer. Soon his life as essence will be completely drained. Gorgoth mentioned that they are keeping him captive through the use of Wardstones. I want you to, to recover these Wardstones and bring them here so we can release Thunderwalker. Recover the Wardstones from Jugnug, Wug, Grunk, and use them to free the them. Find them and use them to free the warlord. Some catapult destruction magic. Did you see the catapults lined up on the way over there? Seems like the ogres are planning to hurl who knows what at our camp. Good thing I came prepared. Cork gave me some of his explosives as a contingency plan. I was going to save them for some enemies back in Ogremar, but I suppose you should use them here instead. Blow up the catapults before they fire on our camp. Never stop innovating. Whatever this is worse takes. than I thought. The ogres were counting on us to stage a rescue attempt. It seems that they plan to attack our camp while they near completion of the ritual. Can't let this happen. Crush the ogres, show them the strength of the Lord. Be vigilant. We have to slay eight ogres. And we have to uh, destroy four catapults. And then we have to get these ward stones. Okay, so we got some ogres over here. One ogre down. Let's see what else we got going on. Another ogre. Let's see the catapults over there. Okay, so let's pull up these catapults. This guy's sleeping. That's that Jugnug guy we're trying to find. Shoot 
shoot him down. Me get smashed. Probably uh, practice using these. Uh, got some boots. These ones are better. Kind of the same. Okay. Probably try this. This ice trap. I haven't tried it yet. Or the freezing trap, I should say. Try it on one of these ogres. Got two more catapults to go. I'll say smash. Me smash. Okay, this is that grunk guy. So we'll place a trap right there. We keep sacrifice. You know, stop it. That's it right there. Yeah, ice rush pretty good. It's like a stun. You just leave it. It's like there's a chest up here I want to get. That's gonna be the last catapult we have to destroy. You gonna stop living? Let's see what's in this chest. Tons of rocks. Still have to find some more ogres, but this is the last one up here. The Wardstone ogres. I'm liking the hunter abilities, like the way. Some destroyed Pokemon. It's freezing right there. I think it's Dot took him out of the trap. There we go. We got all the Wardstones. Now we just need to slay a couple more ogres. Done. I'll try this freezing trap again. So it allows you to like to do another steady shot. That wants to join my group. Should we help him out, guys? Let's help him out for a bit. We got these. We got our quest done. Disable ruins. Holding. We'll help him out. Just pull a bunch of ogres for him. This is like the first person I've grouped up with. Over now. There's a way to like set your interface up so you can like see see people in your group. I think it's raid profiles. Show, use raid party. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Let's see if, see if that works. So I want to use uh, uniframes. This will help us see see the people in our group. Well, I guess see their health bar at least. There we go. See that? You know I kind of I like the Blizzard frames. Quite a stable the UI ones. Too soon. So, like, even if you have a, uh, even if you have like the right like with the regular UI, you would get this. And then you just have like your party members right right there like that. It's doing some decent damage too. So I guess we'll save uh, save this last person. That's the person we have to free. I think he's still looking for ogres. So we'll leave his party for now. Helped him out a little bit. So now we have to destroy these uh, ogre rune stones. Let's do that. Save a Mulgren Thunderwalker. You have my thanks, 
But we must still end the ogre's ritual. How may I aid you? These were the wardstones used to bind me. Perhaps even the ogres have heard the tale of my strength. Thank you for the aid, but saving me will not stop the ogres. They already have enough life essence to complete the ritual. Go in peace. Interested in some experimentation? Good work. You didn't happen to save any of those explosives, did you? I didn't think so. Oh well. I have plenty of other ways to blow up my enemies. See you around. I will be victorious. That should weaken the ogres long enough for us to put an end to their plotting. Strength and honor. All right, so got a new pair of hands. Take that. And we're almost level 10. Peace, and it friend. looks like the next quest, we have to complete a dungeon called Dark Mall Citadel. Ancestors, watch So we're going to save that for next episode. So this is the end of this episode, guys. As always, thanks for watching. Keep your heads up. Later.